When it comes to building muscles, most of us want a simple solution that gets the job done fast and efficiently. That's what it's all about, right? And after 15 plus years of working out, I've tried almost all the exercises you can think of. And the truth is, there are actually exercises that you will want to incorporate, some that you will want to avoid completely, and others that you just can't do without. And in this video, we have narrowed it down to the only eight exercises you need to build the most muscle in the shortest amount of time. Not only that, these are backed by science. By doing these key eight exercises, you will see incredible results even if you don't do any other exercises in the gym. Now, this video is specifically for men, not because women can't benefit from this, but because our goals and body shapes differ in what we are looking for. Men want more of a V and women more of an hourglass. Now, these exercises do cross over, so if you are a woman, you can do them too, and they are great. But let's start with one of the most important exercises. Number one, barbell squats. Barbell squats are a fundamental compound exercise that targets multiple muscle groups at the same time. To perform barbell squats correctly, start by setting up the barbell on a squat rack at the height that allows you to comfortably unrack it while standing. Position yourself under the barbell with your feet shoulder width apart or slightly wider. Grip the barbell with an overhand grip slightly wider than shoulder width apart and rest it across your upper back, just below the base of your neck. Before unracking the barbell, ensure your spine is in a neutral position and engage your core muscles to maintain stability throughout the movement. Once unracked, to take a step back and position your feet firmly on the ground with your toes pointing slightly outward. Initiate the squat by pushing your hips back and bending your knees to lower your body toward the ground. Keep your chest up, back straight, and eyes facing forward throughout the movement. Descend until your thighs are parallel to the ground or slightly below, maintaining control and stability at all times. To return to the position, drive through your heels and extend your hips and knees simultaneously, pushing the marble upward as you stand. Maintain a smooth and controlled motion, avoiding any jerky or abrupt movements. Barbell squats primarily target the quads, hamstrings, and glute muscles. Additionally, they engage the erector spinal muscles of the lower back, as well as the core muscles to stabilize the spine and pelvis during the movement. The benefits of barbell squats are huge. You can increase muscle mass and strength in the quads, hamstrings, and glutes, improve joint stability and mobility in the hips, knees, and ankles, enhance functional movement patterns and biomechanics for activities of daily living, boost athletic performance in sports and activities that require lower body strength and power, and stimulate overall muscle growth and metabolic rate due to the high demand placed on the body during squatting movements. And if those benefits aren't motivating enough, perhaps the hormonal advantages will catch your interest. Compound exercises like squats are known to boost testosterone levels, but is this claim backed by science? According to studies from the Department of Sports Training, performing six sets of 10 squats led to a significant increase in post-exercise testosterone levels. Elevated testosterone levels help stimulate muscle protein synthesis, leading to greater muscle hypotrophy and strength gains over time. Additionally, increased testosterone levels can improve overall workout performance, energy levels, and recovery, allowing individuals to push harder during their training sessions and optimize their muscle building potential. Number two, barbell bench press. The barbell bench press is a fundamental upper body exercise designed to strengthen the chest, shoulders, and tricep muscles. Its primary purpose is to build upper body strength, improve pushing power, and enhance overall upper body development. The barbell bench press offers numerous benefits for your upper body strength and development. By incorporating this exercise into your routine, you can build muscle mass and strength in the chest, shoulders, and triceps, leading to a more proportionate and muscular upper body. Additionally, enhancing upper body aesthetics by developing well-defined chest, shoulder, and arm muscles can contribute to overall physical appearance and confidence. And like squats, studies from UNLV and research by Weiss, Curran, and Thompson share with us that exercises like bench pressing have also been shown to increase testosterone post-exercise to a greater extent than small muscle mass movements when performed above 80% of one rep maximum. To perform the barbell bench press correctly, lie flat on a bench with your feet planted firmly on the ground. Grip the barbell with an overhand grip slightly wider than shoulder width apart. Lower the barbell to your chest in a controlled manner, keeping your elbows tucked close to your body at about a 45 degree angle. 
press the barbell back up to the starting position, fully extending your arms without locking out your elbows. Ensure your back remains flat against the bench throughout the movement and maintain a slight arch in your lower back to stabilize the spine. Keep your shoulders retracted and depressed to prevent excess strain on the shoulder joints. Now real quick, before we move to number three, make sure to hit that subscribe button and notification bell so you never miss a new video from us. And don't forget to hit that like button. Number three, standing dumbbell shoulder press. The standing dumbbell shoulder press's primary purpose is to target the deltoid muscles while also engaging the tricep and upper chest muscles to a lesser extent. This exercise helps improve shoulder stability, overhead strength, and overall upper body function. To perform the standing dumbbell shoulder press correctly, hold a dumbbell in each hand at shoulder height, palms facing forward, and elbows bent at a 90 degree angle. Press the dumbbells overhead until your arms are fully extended, but not locked out and the weights are directly above your shoulders. Lower the dumbbells back to shoulder height in a controlled manner, keeping your core engaged and avoiding excess arching of the lower back. Maintain a neutral spine throughout the movement with your shoulders pulled back and down to avoid shrugging. Keep your head aligned with your spine and avoid leaning back or forward as you press the dumbbells overhead. Exhale as you press the weights up and inhale as you lower them back down to the starting position. As you press the dumbbells overhead, your core muscles, including the abs and lower back muscles, engage to stabilize the spine and prevent excess arching or leaning. This activation of the core muscles helps to improve overall core strength and stability, making the dumbbell shoulder press a beneficial exercise for both upper body and core development. Exercise number four, deadlifts. Deadlifts are a compound weightlifting exercise that primarily targets the muscles of the lower body, including hamstrings, glutes, and lower back. Deadlifts are a timeless compound exercise that engages major muscle groups in your body, making it ideal for stimulating increased testosterone production. The Journal of Strength of Conditioning research found a significant testosterone increase in college-age men after performing heavy deadlifts. Incorporating deadlifts into your workout routine offers several benefits for overall strength, muscle development, and functional fitness. Deadlifts enhance overall strength and muscle mass throughout the body. Moreover, deadlifts increase grip strength and forearm muscularity as they require a strong grip to hold on to the barbell throughout the movement. Finally, deadlifts promote better posture and spinal alignment by strengthening the muscles of the core and lower back which can help alleviate back pain and improve overall posture and spinal health. To perform deadlifts correctly, stand with your feet hip width apart and the barbell positioned over the middle of your feet. Bend at the hips and knees to lower your torso and grip the barbell with an overhand grip, hands shoulder width apart. Keep your back straight, chest up, and core engaged throughout the movement. Push through your heels as you lift the barbell off the ground extending your hips and knees simultaneously until you are standing upright. Pause briefly at the top of the movement, then lower the barbell back down under control to the starting position, maintaining a straight back and keeping the barbell close to your body throughout the lift. Exercise number five, pull-ups slash chin-ups. Pull-ups and chin-ups are bodyweight exercises that involve lifting yourself up to a ball using your arms. Pull-ups involve gripping the bar with your palms facing away from you, while chin-ups involve gripping the bar with your palms facing toward you. Incorporating pull-ups or chin-ups into your workout routine offers several benefits for upper body strength, muscle development, and functional fitness. Pull-ups strengthen the muscles of the upper back, arms, and shoulders, improving the overall upper body strength and muscle definition. To perform pull-ups or chin-ups with proper form, start by gripping the bar with your hands slightly wider then shoulder width apart for pull-ups, or with your hands shoulder width apart and palms facing toward you for chin-ups. Hang from the bar with your arms fully extended and your body straight, engaging your core muscles to maintain stability. Pull yourself up toward the bar by bending your elbows and squeezing your shoulder blades together, aiming to bring your chin above the bar. Lower yourself back down to the starting position in a controlled manner, fully extending your arms before beginning the next repetition. Avoid swinging or using momentum to lift yourself up and focus on using your upper body strength to perform the movement. Exercise number six, barbell rows. Barbell rows are a compound exercise that primarily targets the muscles of the upper back, including the lats, rhomboids, and traps, while also engaging the biceps, forearms, and core muscles. 
Incorporating barbell rows into your workout routine offers several benefits for upper body strength, muscle development, and functional fitness. Barbell rows help improve posture by targeting the muscles responsible for pulling the shoulders back and down, which can reduce the risk of developing postural imbalances and associated pain or discomfort. To perform barbell rows with proper form, start by standing with your feet hip width apart and the barbell positioned over the middle of your feet. Bend at the hips and knees to lower your torso and grip the barbell with an overhand grip, hands slightly wider than shoulder width apart. Keep your back straight, chest up, and core engaged throughout the movement. Pull the barbell towards your lower chest or abs by retracting your shoulder blades and bending your elbows, keeping the barbell close to your body. Lower the barbell back down under control to the starting position, maintaining a straight back and avoiding excess swinging. Exercise number seven, power cleans. Power cleans are an explosive weightlifting exercise that focuses on full body power development and coordination. The primary purpose of power cleans is to improve explosive strength, speed, and power by rapidly lifting a barbell from the floor to the shoulders in one fluid motion. This exercise is commonly used by athletes and strength trainers to enhance athletic performance, particularly in sports that require explosive movements like sprinting, jumping, and throwing. To perform power cleans with proper form, start by standing with your feet hip width apart and the barbell positioned over the middle of your feet. Bend at the hips and knees to lower your torso and grip the barbell with an overhand grip, hands slightly wider than shoulder width apart, keeping your back straight, chest up, and core engaged throughout the movement. Explosively extend your hips, knees, and ankles to generate upward momentum, pulling the barbell off the floor and quickly transitioning into a front squat position. As the barbell reaches hip level, shrug your shoulders and pull yourself under the bar, catching it on your shoulders in a rack position. Stand up tall to complete the lift, then lower the barbell back down to the starting position. Incorporating power cleans into your workout routine offers several benefits for overall athletic performance and functional fitness. By performing this exercise, you can improve explosive strength and power by developing fast twitch muscle fibers and enhancing the body's ability to generate force quickly. Additionally, power cleans can enhance speed and agility by improving coordination, balance, and neuromuscular efficiency. For athletes, research from the International Journal of Strength and Conditioning has consistently shown that those who excel in the one rep max hang power clean relative to their body mass tend to exhibit superior performance in activities like jumping and sprinting. Exercise number eight, push-ups. Push-ups are a fundamental body weight exercise that involves lowering and raising your body by pushing against the ground with your arms. The primary purpose of push-ups is to strengthen the muscles of the chest, shoulders, and arms while also engaging the core muscles for stability. Push-ups are versatile and can be performed anywhere without the need of equipment, making them a convenient and effective exercise for improving upper body strength and endurance. They also improve core stability and balance by engaging the muscles of the core and lower body to maintain proper form and alignment during the exercise. Finally, push-ups can be easily modified to increase or decrease the level of difficulty, making them accessible to individuals of all fitness levels and abilities. To perform push-ups with proper form, start in a plank position with your hands slightly wider than shoulder width apart and your arms fully extended. Keep your body in a straight line from your head to your heels, engaging your core muscles to maintain stability. Lower your body towards the ground by bending your elbows, keeping them close to your sides until your chest nearly touches the ground. Avoid sagging your hips or arching your lower back during the movement. Push through your palms to strain your arms and return to the starting position, fully extending your elbows at the top of the movement. Maintain a controlled pace throughout the exercise and focus on contracting the muscles of the chest, shoulders, and arms. And there you have it, the only eight exercises men need to build muscle backed by science. As you consider incorporating these exercises into your routine, Remember that consistency is key. Start gradually focusing on mastering proper form and technique before progressing to heavier weights. Set realistic goals, track your progress, and celebrate your achievements along the way. Now it's your turn. Hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell, and like this video for more. See you in the next one.